Hi everyone, long time no talk, big news, I'm married! Um, yeah, it was a great weekend. Um, we got married Saturday, everything was great. We did not get a duck up the aisle, but we did, um, one of my friends who was in charge of the getting the animals up the aisle, the ducks and the dogs, managed to catch one of the babies and carry it up. It was, it was chaotic and funny. I was trying to like herd the ducks up the aisle, or she was trying to herd the ducks up the aisle, and I just like took off after them in, in my like my wedding dress. I was wearing Birkenstocks, even though like I had these beautiful high heels, but um, you know, weddings never go to plan, and ours didn't, but it was chaotic and fun and perfect. So um, that's the quick update on our wedding more excitingly well okay maybe for you guys not for me this is the most exciting thing for me we have new ducks um this is our crew right now look at how big the babies are um yeah they're huge so we'll be announcing names soon but we have three new ducks um shoot that's battling okay we have new anacondas we're getting used to them that one right there is new and that one is new they're much bigger than ours which is really interesting um so my mother-in-law gave them to us um she hatched some some eggs from a farm that she, she purchased some eggs from a farm and hatched them and those were out of them they're much larger than ours they're even i feel um bigger than Bruce, even, who's a drake. They're both girls. Um, so that's exciting. And right there, that black one, is our new muscovy who looks a lot like an Ancona. <laughs> um, they don't have names yet. Well, they do. One of them does. Um, we will be announcing names soon. Brightling is getting so big over there. Um, and is now starting to finally be friends with the big ducks, and I'm so happy for him. Um, it's been a long time of him being kind of confused and lonely, so he's a big boy now. As far as who all is being kept, um, battling right there, and where's Sap? Sapling is right there. Um... They will be going to their new home at my mother-in-law's, my official mother-in-law's, not even future mother-in-law, official. Sorry, I'm a little over the top about this. Um, next weekend, no, the weekend after next. Um, and that's wriggling right there. Where's Red? Where's Red? Red! Redling is somewhere. He's fine, don't worry, I saw him today. So he's off just, oh, there's Red. That's Redling, I don't know if you can see him. Hi, Red. That's Red. Um, they will be going to their new homes. We are undecided about Brightling because obviously I'm a little attached. And um, so that's a problem and also, <laughs> My whole family loved him, because <laughs> uh, he's so he's so good with people. My everybody loved him at the wedding, and it just kind of makes it even harder, I think, for me to be willing to give him up. Um, so I'm we're still on the fence about whether or not we're willing to sell him or not. So there you go. There's our duck update. We do have someone. Let's go check in the coop. Hey buddy, are you doing okay? Are you getting kind of warm there? Get off. There was a fly on me, sorry. Hi Bubbo. Hi little guy. Yeah, we have some nice chocolates. Um, I don't know if my mother-in-law is going to want to take them. Oh, so let's talk about some real quick gender differences that you can see at this age. So on either side, so this duck, that's Rig, he's a boy. That's Hazel, she's a girl. Um wriggling and hazeling so you can already kind of see they're the same age but you can see that rig is already much bigger and longer than hazel over here see how like long he is compared to hazel um some other changes that you can start to see is that riggy riggy's head is longer and kind of flatter 
and Hazel's kept a, you know, a nice round head. Um, they're not standing, so I can't see their legs. Um, let's see if I can see their tails. Not quite. So as they get older, their tails will change a little bit. So you see Natasha's tail is nice and slender and comes down to a point. Whereas if I can get Wanda to turn around, you'll see how big and flat his tail is. You can kind of see how flat his tail shape is and like wide. Bucky's. I'm not coming for you, buddy. You can hang tight. Bucky's tail. Buck. You see Bucky's tail? Look at how big and wide it is. That's more of a male tail. You can see how wide and flat they are. The girls have a more slender pointed tail. They're, the little one's tails haven't quite gotten into there yet. Um, hi guys. If Rig or Red would stand up, you could see their feet and legs, but we got nice small feet. These are um, Bee's feet. They're kind of small and her legs are a little bit thinner than what we'll see on Rig and Red if they stand up. There's Rig. See his feet, his legs are so chunky and his feet are bigger. Um, so those are some of the differences in males and females are the same age. Yeah, can you see like the difference? It's hard to see, the sunlight's not great. But you can see how big his feet are and his legs are chunky. Um, see what I mean? He also has a very large step. Whereas these guys have much small, the little ones have, the girls have much smaller steps. So anyway, there are some gender differences. <laughs> Behind us is where I got married. Sorry, this video is all over the place because there's been a lot going on. Um, but let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, I'm going to extend the competition for virtual adopt a duck um, to 8 p.m. Central Time tonight for the thing. So you can either comment here or I'll post a link to the original and you can comment there if you want to be entered. Um, Quackling has a name, so Cloudling will be up for a name as well as our other new Ancana will be up for a name. So yeah, the other new Ancana. So comment here if you want to be entered into that drawing or comment on the original video, which I will post in the about section, a link to that video. And we will be drawing oh, tonight. I'll do the drawing tonight and post tomorrow morning about who won. So um, that's it for the updates. Thanks for your patience, guys. And we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.